Hey again everyone, Heat Floor with 1x5 Games here. We're going to open a couple different types of packaging for Guilds of Ravnica. We have uh, three standard packs. Put those aside. We'll have the pack from Target, which is in its little cardboard container there. And then we'll have Rawl the Planeswalker deck. So we're going to go ahead and open up him first. And what I'll do is I'll just open up the packs. So you can see if there's any real bonus to purchasing one way or the other. I'm sure the odds are probably similar no matter how you dice it. What we're looking for hopefully is a Doom Whisperer or uh, let's see Assassin's Trophy would be nice. Alright so the first thing I notice is the Mythic Foil, Rawl, Collar of Storms, is, well, it's bent. Pretty damn bad. And I had that feeling when I was looking at the box originally. They just did a piss poor job of protecting that card, so... That one's probably going to be a useless card. I don't think I'll be able to sell that. I'll just throw that to the side. Maybe we'll find him again. Maybe we won't. So in here they have a seated pack. And then we have two fresh packs. So let's take a look at the seated pack here. Sometimes these pull tabs don't separate as easy as you'd think. Let's see if I can. There we go. It's a beautiful day in our neighborhood today. Hope everyone's having a great day. Appreciate you taking the time to check out what we're doing all right our uh, rare erratic cyclops omni spell adept rawls dispersal times two and then is this just a bunch of commons here oh no nope. stack of commons and we have some uncommons hellkite whelp Times two. I'm sure those probably aren't worth much since everyone probably gets the same type of cards. Rawls Staticaster times two, three. We Dragonauts. That's kind of an interesting card. Times two. And then we got a bunch of lands here. Bunch of lands followed by some more uncommons. Chemister's Insight. Okay. The uncommons are kind of mixed in, jumbled in there. Sonic Soul. I love that card. I hope I can find it in foil one day. Okay. Gives you a description of what you should do when you play, if you ever actually play. And a code for... The arena. Nice. Here. Anyone want that code? It's all yours. Alright. Let's see what we have in the packs that came in here. And I just want to kind of compare here. Eh, they look the same other than they're squished. Alright. Kind of unsquish that here. Alright, what do we got? Everyone knows the commons by now. Pretty relatively old set. Chemister's Insight. Oh, that looks familiar. Book Devourer. That's kind of cool. Used to be me back in the day when I was a kid. World Soul Colossus. 
Temple Garden for Rare and Gate and a Token. Nothing too fancy there. Yeah, when I was a teenager, I used to read the hell out of books. Nowadays, I have a hard time not falling asleep. Let's see here. Go through our commons real quick. Demotion for our uncommon. Glauspor Shaman. Sunhome Stalwart. And Risk Factor for our rare. Okay, another gate and token. Let's take a look at the target line up here. I hate how they do these. I always feel like I'm going to ruin the cards. I'm making a nice mess here on the table. All for your enjoyment. Okay. Looks like a little tear there. Yeah. This is the one I got for Target. Let's see if there's anything special in it. Sometimes I love that. I don't know how many times I've said that, but I absolutely love that. I need to find that in foil. Conclave Cavalier. Glaive of the Guild Pact. There we go. Legion Guild Mage. And Draining, I'm sorry, Deafening Clarion. Okay. Last three packs from the game shop. One of the game shops. There's a couple, there's only two game stores in town. Second Star Games is definitely our go-to, but every once in a while I gotta take the kids to get a comic book or two, and that's at a different store. So, after you build up enough credit, you can get uh, free packs, so I do that. Night Vale Predator. Gird for Battle. Thoughtbound Phantasm. And Runaway Steamkin. So, yeah, I always feel guilty when I go there. But no, no other store in town has real comic books. Since they're all mostly digital these days. Man, I want that in foil too. And we don't have a Barnes & Noble anymore. Ledev Champion, Plague Crafter, Goblin Banneret. Ooh, oh, here we go. We have Arclight Phoenix Mythic. That's actually worth something. Take Heart Foil. That's beautiful. Some lands. Closest Barnes and Nobles, I believe Barnes and Noble is an hour away or so. And uh, I've ordered comic books online a couple times, but it's it's always iffy. You never know what you're gonna what, what condition it's gonna come in. Swarm Guild Mage, Lava Coil, Silent Dart. Light of the Legion for a rare. That's it. So, not too bad there from the other game store. We got a nice mythic. Better than nothing. Uh, so, yeah, I definitely wouldn't recommend the, the guild packs. That was kind of a waste of money. Won't be doing that again. Hope you guys uh, stay tuned. Stick around. Like, share, tweet, retweet, do all that fun stuff. We have a lot more unboxings to go. We have quite a few pre-sales for a wide variety of magic. And also we're going to start digging into some of these uh, trading card games that have failed. 
Thank you very much. You guys have a great night. Cheers.